episode one. At the very beginning, there was the core concept, the boxer engine. A horizontally opposed engine, also known as a boxer engine, consists of pistons that move toward each other in a horizontal direction, much like boxers throwing punches. Subaru remains committed to using this horizontally opposed design. The reason is because the boxer engine comes with many inherent advantages. Low center of gravity, Inline engine, V engine, boxer engine. The boxer engine has a lower center of gravity than an inline engine or V engine, and it is this lower center of gravity that gives rise to better stability. Low vibrations mean low noise. The Boxer engine has minimal vibrations and simply outstanding durability. Despite its numerous advantages, there are many other factors that must be overcome for the Boxer engine to be used as a mass production engine. The engine consists of a complex production process and requires extensive costs for production and development. Today, there are only two companies in the world, one of which is Subaru, that produce horizontally opposed engines for use in cars. Subaru has been producing the Boxer engine for more than 40 years. How did Subaru achieve this? Development of Japan's very first boxer engine. Shinroku Momose was the engineer in charge of development at the time. As the chief engineer responsible for pushing development of the boxer engine, today he is regarded as something of a legend. The R&D team was aware of the advantages that the boxer engine presented, but they were faced with various difficulties during the development stage. Uh, Never give up. The spirit of those Subaru engineers lives on to this day. Mr. Momose was responsible for making an all-important decision. He used expensive aluminium to construct engine blocks in an attempt to make them lighter. Using aluminium alloy gave rise to an engine weight that was approximately 15% lighter than other inline four-cylinder engines of the same class. Development of the first Japanese boxer engine was complete. Subaru 1000. At the time, a longitudinal, horizontally opposed front-wheel drive engine layout was a simply groundbreaking concept. In the 45 years since the first Boxer engine was produced, Subaru has made continuous developments to its design. All of this knowledge is the direct result of years of constant effort. Subaru has been solely committed to the horizontally opposed engine. The EJ25 turbo engine was awarded the International Engine of the Year in 2008. The Boxer diesel engine was ranked third in its own class. 
This is concrete evidence that uses adore the Boxer engine and the advantages of its low center of gravity, low vibrations and compact size. At the time, another reason Mr. Momose decided to go with the Boxer engine was so that users could instantly see that the system was simply innovative in every regard. This remains a key aspect of Subaru corporate philosophy to this day. Forty-four years on. Development of the third generation Boxer engine was complete. Above all, the new Boxer engine is environmentally friendly. The engine is capable of generating impressive amounts of power from a minimal amount of petrol and has a reliable torque curve. Various forms of loss throughout the engine have been eliminated wherever possible to improve efficiency. A range of technologies developed has led to the compact size of the engine. The third generation engine is assembled at this state-of-the-art factory. Let's take a closer look at how the engine is produced and assembled. The process begins by casting the aluminium block. The compact blocks are then sent to the assembly line after being polished and washed. The Boxer engine assembly process is complex and requires much time and effort. The engine consists of a large number of parts as the pistons are located on each side of the engine. Perhaps its most attractive feature is that the piston heads are assembled symmetrically from the crankshaft. This shape is what leads to the low center of gravity. The difficult process of connecting pistons that face opposite each other to a single crankshaft has been overcome through the development of angled split connecting rods, giving rise to the use of robots for mass production on this assembly line. This specially designed dolly allows tasks to be conducted on the symmetrical engine block from many angles without having to lower the engine. With such a compact engine block, the dolly requires only minimal space. Because the pistons face opposite each other on either side of the engine, it takes two times as long to assemble the heads compared to other types of engines. For greater quality, parts are controlled using a QR code system. え、新しい工場ということで品質、え、環境に対する影響ですね。こちらの方は当然トップのレベルを目指すというところで作っていましたけど、え、何よりも重視しているところはやはりあのこれからの市場変化の対応に柔軟に対応するためにフレキシブル